Did you all know? In-game costumes are actually confirmed for the upcoming Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles. Don't believe me? Well stay tuned. And that being said, if you guys end up enjoying this video, drop a like. We are on the road to 1k subscribers. The goal is to make that happen before the game comes out. So if you guys want to support your homie Zoro, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon, and let's continue on with the video. As you all know, a couple of days ago, we got the release date for the JP version of Demon Slayer Hinokami Chronicles. And as I mentioned in my previous video, we did not just get the release date announced. We got a lot of other things announced as well, like a PS4 exclusive limited edition bundle for the game as well, which has a lot of goodies. So if you guys have not seen that video, link will be in the top right hand corner right now. So make sure you guys watch that video. A lot of information on what's in that bundle. And in that video, I gave a small mentioned that there are now confirmed in-game costumes everybody that is huge so with that limited edition bundle we got in-game costumes which was also confirmation that costumes are gonna be in the game and shout out to the boy jamatsu for you know linking up all that detailed stuff that's gonna be in the limited edition so in terms of in-game costumes the only confirmed ones we have as of now are the butterfly mansion patient costumes you guys are looking at a reference on the television screen right now on the concept art for those costumes but yo take it in now since costumes are now confirmed you guys can expect cc2 to keep dishing out a lot of costumes most likely free with the game as well as you complete story mode you unlock different variants of the character dlc costume sets as well as we all know naruto storm series had them and this game also being developed by CC2, yo, expect a lot more costumes in the future for this game. So it is absolutely hype. Now, one thing I want to mention in this video, I really want CC2 to bring in crossover costumes. That being from either Naruto or Dragon Ball Z, have Tanjo in the Goku outfit, have Rengoku in a Goku outfit. Yo, that is going to be absolutely smoke, like literal smoke. Yo, who does not want to see crossover costumes? I would love to see it. And Naruto Storm series in the past has done it with Dragon Ball Z where Naruto had a Goku costume everybody so that's absolutely insane. Hopefully the same happens for this game as well because I love customization. Customizing keeps the game fresh for me you know like I like playing my characters the original way as well but from time to time I want to spice it up get a new feel to it look aesthetically pleasing in game as well according to my own needs. So you guys, this was a video just to let you guys know in-game costumes are confirmed. Let me know in the comment section below what costumes you guys think will be available in the game or what costume you guys want to see come in potentially in the future which are maybe crossover costumes from a specific character from Naruto or Dragon Ball Z or a different anime you guys want to reference to. So if you guys enjoyed this video, consider dropping a like, hit the subscribe button, Hit the bell icon to be notified whenever I post a video. And we are on the road to 1,000 subscribers. The goal is to make that happen before the game comes out. So you guys, support your homie Zoro. Hit the subscribe button and let's get to that 1K mark as soon as possible. And with that, mad love, Zoro signing out. And I'll see you all in the next one.